Hello friends, welcome to engineering tutorial. Uh, in my previous videos, uh, we discussed about the representation of sign numbers in a binary form and we discussed three methods that is the sign magnitude system, the 1s complement system and the 2s complement system. There we discussed how to represent the a given integer be it positive or negative in binary form. In today's video, we are going to do the opposite. How to determine the decimal value or the particular value of the integer from the binary representation. Okay? So, we know that there are three methods of uh, representation, three systems that are used. First is sign magnitude, second is 1s complement and third is 2s complement. Okay? These are the three systems that we discussed. So, the methods of approach to determine the decimal value will be different for different systems. Okay? So, in today's video, we are going to discuss about the sign magnitude system that is calculation of the decimal value of the integer in sign magnitude system and we will discuss about the same related to 1s and 2s complement system in separate videos. Okay? So, today's discussion is about the evaluation of decimal value of a given sign number in sign magnitude system. Okay? So, let us discuss about that. Suppose we have been given a number 1011. It has been mentioned in the question that it is represented using sign magnitude system using 4 bit format. Okay? It has been mentioned that it is represented using sign magnitude system in 4 bit format. So, in order to determine its decimal value, the first step and the most important is examination of the sign bit. In the sign magnitude system video, okay, you please check out the sign magnitude 1s complement and 2s complement representation of binary system. There are three separate videos in the channel. You please check out that so that you understand these concepts in a better way. So, the first step is the examination of the sign bit, which is the extreme left bit or the MSB bit. Okay. When the sign bit is 0, it means that the given number is positive and when it is 1, it means that the given number is negative. So, here the sign bit is 1, okay? the sign bit is 1. So, it means it is a negative number, it is a negative number. The remaining 3 bits they are the magnitude bits, okay? the magnitude bits, which determine the magnitude of the number. The sign bit represents the sign, the determ it determines the sign of the number and the remaining bits determine the magnitude of the number. So, 0, 1, 1, okay? this is in binary, in decimal value it is 3. So, the given number 1, 0, 1, 1, which is represented using sign magnitude system is actually minus 3. <coughs> okay? 1 is in the sign bit, that is why the negative sign. The magnitude bits, it is 0, 1, 1 in binary form, in decimal equivalent, it is 3. So, 1, 0, 1, 1 which is represented in sign magnitude system here is minus 3. Let us take another example. Okay? Here a number is given 1000000 then 1100. 
So, here also the first step is the examination of the sine bit, the leftmost bit, the MSB bit. Here also it is 1, the sine bit is 1. So, here also the number is negative, here also the number is negative. Now, the remaining the magnitude bits, they are 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 0, 0. We know that zeros on the left hand side, they have no value, so we can ignore them. We have to only consider this part, 1, 1, 0, 0. So, 1, 1, 0, 0, okay, 1, 1, 0, 0. It is in binary form, its decimal equivalent is 2 to the power 3 plus 2 to the power 2, which is 8 plus 4, that is 12. Okay, it is 12. So, the given number 1 triple 0, 1 1 double 0, which is represented in sign magnitude 8 bit format, okay, sign magnitude 8 bit format, pay attention. It is mentioned in the question that it is represented in sign magnitude 8 bit format. In decimal form, its equivalent value is minus 12. Why minus 12? This minus sign came because the sign magnitude, the sign bit, okay, the sign bit, which is the left hand, extreme left hand bit or the MSB bit, it is 1. When the sign bit is 1, it means that the given number is negative. The remaining bits, which are the magnitude bits here, we converted into it to it, its equivalent decimal form and we got the value as 12. Okay, it is actually 2 to the power 3, 1 into 2 to the power 3 plus 1 into 2 to the power 2 plus 0 plus 0, which is 12. So, the given number is minus 12. This sign magnitude represented sign number. Let us take some more examples to understand it in a better way. Okay, here we have another uh, number which is represented using sign magnitude system using 8 bit format. So, we have to find out the decimal value of this number. So, the first step again is to examine the leftmost MSB bit. Here it is 1 again. So, it means it is a negative number because when the sign bit is 1, it is a negative number. Now, the remaining bits, the magnitude bits, okay, 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1. The sign bit is 1, so it is a negative number. Magnitude bits are 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, one. We can ignore these three zeros. One 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 means it is fifteen. Okay, it is in binary form. The equivalent decimal representation will be fifteen in decimal form. So the given number, okay, this number which is represented in sign magnitude system, it is actually minus fifteen. Okay, now here. Can you guess just by looking at this number what will be its value? See, here the first step examination of the sign bit. It is 0, okay, here it is 0. It means that the given number is positive because the sign bit is 0, so the given number is positive. The remaining magnitude bits, they are the same as just here, the same. The magnitude bits are the same in these two numbers, only the sign bits have changed. So, here the magnitude bits are 0, 0, 0, 1, 1, 1, 1, the same. So, it is also here the magnitude decimal value, the decimal representation is 15. Here the magnitude is 15, okay, but what about the sign? The sign bit is 0. So, it is a positive number. So, here this number, okay, 4 zeros followed by 4 ones, it is actually plus 15. 
So, you see the change here the sign bit is 1, the magnitude bits are the same, sign bit is 1. So, the number is negative minus 15. Here the sign bit is 0, the magnitude bits are the same as that of the previous number. So, here the magnitude stays same that is 15, but the sign changes to plus because the sign bit is 0. Okay? So, this is how you approach a sign magnitude represented number. The first step is the examination of the sign bit, check whether the sign bit is 0 or 1 which is the extreme left hand bit, the MSB bit. So, if it is 0, it is a positive number, if it is 1, it is a negative number. Next step is to examine the magnitude bits, convert the magnitude bits in binary form into their equivalent decimal form, whether you use whatever method, the sum of weights or uh, the repeated, uh, sorry, the sum of weights method or just by looking you can find out, uh, you can do that. So, then you determine the value, the magnitude value of that number, then depending on the sign bit, you put the sign, be it plus or minus, plus in case of 0 as sign bit and minus in case of 1 in the sign bit position. Okay, so, here we have discussed about how to determine the decimal value of a uh, uh, sign number which is represented in sign magnitude system. Okay? So, again the important thing is to check in the question whether the number is represented in which system, in which format, whether it is represented in sign magnitude or 1s complement or 2s complement because the approaches will be different. Okay? So, please take note of that, special note of that. So, I hope you like this video. And please subscribe my channel Engineering Tutorial for more such videos related to electrical electronics instrumentation and communication engineering. Have a great day. Thank you very much.